DataKit is a powerful cross-platform data serialization system for saving and loading your game's data. It automatically handles low-level file I.O., save slots, save points, screenshots, encryption, and more. Let's take a look at what makes DataKit so unique. Data is typically very abstract, written through code and not always easy to debug. DataKit turns this on its head by making data easy to set up and debug with its easy to use visual editors. You're not limited to just strings and numbers either. DataKit has support for more than 45 common data types, with more to be introduced with updates. In DataKit, data can either be global or local. Global data can be thought of as persistent, used for things like storing graphic settings or keeping track of in-app purchases. Local data tracks the player's progress and can be saved into save points. All of your local and global data keys are organized into groups, which encourages better data design, especially if you have a lot of data keys to save. It's important to mention that data keys and groups can easily be added, edited or deleted at runtime. In addition to save points, DataKit also allows you to set up save slots. This feature allows you to simulate different user accounts or perhaps different characters in an RPG. DataKit can automatically create screenshots to be used as thumbnails and even offers options for local obfuscation and encryption. The best thing about this is DataKit handles all of these low-level file management operations and features automatically. All you need to do is tell DataKit what and when to load and save. DataKit can serialize any compatible reference type by value, including texture 2Ds, meshes, and more. However, if you'd like to reference an asset in your project that resides in the Resources folder, DataKit offers a unique option of using the Reference Database system. This tool allows you to save and load compatible objects directly by reference, in the same way as value types. When testing your games in the editor, viewing your data in real time is typically not as easy as it could be. DataKit offers a great solution for debugging your data in real time using the DataKit debugger. Another great feature DataKit has is the ability to preload your data in the editor while testing any scene in your game. In other words, this allows you to test the scene with specific global and local data preloaded before the scene even starts. This speeds up testing and best of all, it works seamlessly. All you need to do is press play in the editor and DataKit takes care of the rest. Scripting with the API revolves around the DataKit event system. No need to have complicated update loops. Just subscribe to the events you need and DataKit will let you know when to act. There are eight well-commented example scenes covering saving and loading local and global data, different ways of handling references, tracking instantiated objects, and even a fully functional file management UI you can use as a template in your own games. Feel free to take a look at our in-depth documentation PDF file as well as the several DataKit tutorial videos that are freely available. Thanks so much for taking the time to check out DataKit. If you have any questions, feel free to visit the forum or send me an email. I'm always happy to help. Cheers.